It's been probably four or five years since I've hunted Missouri. This was one of the first places I hunted out of state and I've always loved coming up here hunting Missouri. So we're set up here in Missouri. This is our first afternoon. This morning we saw a bunch of deer. Uh, had a really good hunt. Saw four or five does, a couple young bugs. Uh, come in here yesterday afternoon and set this stand up. Let's lock on right on the edge of this cornfield. Got some thick brush behind me, some trees, got a ditch just running through it, and it looks like they're traveling this ditch behind me and around this cornfield, uh, so it's looking promising, there's a ton of sign, uh, we're just glad to be able to get up here, hunt Missouri. Okay, so after several days of hunting, I've moved around, uh, been seeing some deer, uh, moved off to a new property, which was right up on the Iowa line and Kenyon was like, this is it guys, this is the spot, the honey hole. There was just not a tree on our property that was big enough for, to hang a lock on in. And finally, I just said, heck with it. There was one tree that was like a fence post, about as big as round as my arm. And I was like, I'm putting a lock on in there because there was just trails all around that tree, just everywhere. All right, here we are set up the last afternoon here in Missouri. And uh, it's cooled off a little bit. The wind's blowing hard. Um, walking in, there was several deer already here. We bumped them. Hopefully that won't screw us up for the afternoon. But sat here this morning and saw a lot of deer. I had a lot of action this morning. Small bucks running does had several two, three year old bucks that just come blowing through running does, and we never even got them on camera. I was not sitting there probably 30 minutes and I see a buck coming through the woods. Well, I'm Brooke with Real South Hunting and I want to tell you thank you for watching the show. And I want to tell you how you can keep up with us in real time. If you'll go to our Facebook page, give us a like. If you'll go to our Instagram and give us a follow, that will let you keep up with us as things are happening. You can also go to realsouthhunting.com and check out some of our content on there. You can also purchase a hat there in our online store. We have over 30 different styles and colors. Each purchase helps us create the content that you're seeing now. We appreciate you watching the show and we appreciate each and every one of you that go out there and buy a hat to show support for Real South Hunting.
Missouri bucks on. We hadn't been in the stand not 20 minutes and this dude come walking through the woods right to me. I mean, I shot him right there, maybe 10 yards. I mean, he come right to me and he's laying dead right there. But wow, thank you, Lord. Give God all the praise. It's amazing, give God all the praise. All right, we just got out of the stand. I'm about to go take a look at this dude. Walk over here so you can find my hair. There's my hair right there. That's what you want to see right there. Yes, sir. That right there, my friends, is a big Missouri buck. Who got it? Wow. Got it done here in Missouri. This joker is big, big old buck. Heavy, heavy, he's been rubbing. That's just a fine, fine buck for up here in Missouri. Last day, last hunt. I'm talking about hadn't been in the stand 20 minutes. And this old dude come out, look at that. Look at the body on them. These deer up here are so huge. I'm just so happy and blessed to get it done here the last evening last hunt of the trip we're headed to illinois brother john woolwine or woolwine dodge he's already there he's hunting this afternoon we're headed over to meet him but first we gotta take care of this big guy what a giant what a giant